All right, folks, here we go from Las Vegas. Brian Blessing, bangthebook.com. Fired up to be with you. Always fun talking about the NFL Week 4. And how about a big showdown? We got the high-flying Kansas City Chiefs taking on the unbeaten Detroit Lions, who were 2-0-1. If they didn't squander that lead against Arizona uh, in Week 1, had an 8-point lead at the closing seconds of that game, they'd be unbeaten. Well, listen, give Detroit some credit here. Uh, showed a lot of fight in these games. Now, I'm not saying it's smoke and mirrors. They've done a lot of good things. But don't forget, they caught Philadelphia the week after a really physical game against Atlanta. They used a kick return, turnovers, whatever it is. They found a way to beat the Eagles. Uh, and I'm not saying you take it with a grain of salt. Give them full marks for walking into Philly and getting the win there. But this is jumping into the real deep end of the pool. And in a weird way for Kansas City, the Tyreek Hill injury uh, is a kind of a blessing in disguise because all these other wide receivers are now stepping up to the plate and Mahomes is playing at an incredible level. The one thing I would say here, this number was sitting at seven. It's down to six and I get the home dog making some money here. Detroit, they're going on to a bye. Would they love to be unbeaten going to a bye early in the season? Uh, the reality is I, I think this Kansas City team is going to have their way and go up and down the field. Uh, plus Darius Slay may be nicked up for the Lions. The one thing I would say uh, I, I'm looking at track meet city here. I think Stafford's going to have his moments at home. I could see these two teams out of conference game going up and down the field. 53 and a half, it's a high total. Uh, but I think, you know, this is a game uh, should be in the 30s by halftime. I'm looking for a track meet. I got to lead Kansas City's way too, an out of conference game. But the fact that it is an out of conference game also lends itself to a lack of familiarity and an up tempo game. And Matt Stafford, believe me, uh, he's capable of slinging around really good, but he's also capable of making mistakes and creating short fields. Got to go kind of chalky here. Kansas City in the over. Looking for a fun game, though, with two teams off to a great start in the NFL and out of conference game coming your way in week four here at the NFL. Brian Blessing, bangthebook.com. Always a treat to be with you right here at bangthebook.com.